The Dark River Derby Coalition was founded in Quincy two and a half years ago. From the looks of it, you would think these ladies have been skating their whole lives. But in reality, some of these players joined the team with barely any skating experience. Megan Deusterhouse was one of them. I thought I'm going to be terrible. I haven't skated since junior high and I wasn't that good at it then. And starting the sport up again wasn't something she planned. I actually was talked into being a volunteer by uh, a friend and I was the bout coordinator for their first season. So I was a volunteer and I kind of just made, thing, made sure things flowed smoothly and everything is set up and it, you kind of get sucked in after that because you see how much fun everyone's having on the track and you just you have to join. But before you get pulled into the sport, you need to know a few things. One, roller derby isn't exactly a casual skate around the rink. It's more physical than that. It, it's a total body workout, but uh, skaters are always kind of complaining like our socks don't fit anymore because our muscles are getting too developed or my knee pads I have to go a size up because they've gotten too tight. Um, so you have to kind of be prepared that you're going to put on some actual muscle. Also, be prepared to fall and know how to do it safely. So you don't want to be out of control. If you're going to fall down, you at least want to not be all over the rink tripping other people or breaking a bone. But if you're not ready to dive into a derby yet, try Open Skate. It's a great way to work out, especially for kids. It's neat to see kids roller skating and their faces are kind of pink and rosy and they don't realize that they're actually exercising while they're out there having fun. And it's such good exercise, um, specifically roller derby is great for endurance, um, agility, core strength, flexibility. So whether you're jamming at the roller derby or enjoying a casual couple skate, you're going to break a sweat. Just don't break a bone. Kristen Aguirre, KHQA News, Quincy.